The sky is clear and the sun is shining. Time to get the Yoni Kabuto out for some training. I'm the one who's supposed to be adored by the kids. Me! Hmm. Not if I have anything to say about it. To survive hardship, you must prepare for hardship. Keep your weapon at the ready. You never know what's around the corner. I mean, they had a Yoimiya, so I'm pretty sure this doggo is dead. Yoimiya, you pepeg! And then, this part. It's really just that easy, right? That, that's how easy it is to destroy Ito's future. We got Ito, and then they drip marketed Shenha, Yunjin, and then during Ito trailer, they, they show you 5 seconds of Ayato's voice line and now before Ito banner they show you 5 seconds of Yunjin. Nice suit you got? Yes, it's very nice. Alright, Ito's banner, huh? Ito, Zhang Ling, Goro, Barbara. If you are pulling this banner and you're hoping for like getting Goro and Ito, that's gonna be pain because I'm sure a lot of people will get Ito before getting any copies of Goro. It happens so often. We already kind of went through Ito and Goro performance, right? Ito and Goro as a combo plus one more Geo character for a triple Geo team would be pretty good. The damage numbers will be kind of reliable and if you enjoy the animations of Ito, they'll keep you occupied for quite a while. So there's that, yeah? I think they're alright pulls. They're nice pull. They're not gonna be groundbreaking, but you're mostly playing Ito for the animation. And the attack animation, right? Or maybe some some of the voice lines. They're alright. I wouldn't recommend Geo characters if you're a completely new player to the game still. Because Geo character for new players is kind of pain to build. As for Barbara and Zhang Ling. Zhang Ling, Constellation 4 is good. Barbara is Barbara. Even with the new Clam set, Barbara can't really use it. Because the only two characters that can really use the new glam set is Kokomi and Chi Chi. Barbara healing isn't consistent enough to proc high amounts of healing from the glam set. This banner, well, you're mainly pulling for the star, right? To pull this banner, you're mainly pulling for the star, which is Ito. And Goro as the buffer for Ito. It's kind of nice. I, I, okay. Depends on how you see it, but... I kind of like them making artifact sets for specific character or making supports for specific characters or specific elements, right? Like Sara with Raiden and Goro for Ito. I think that's nicer. Because I hope the game moves to the point where more there's more niche character that works in certain scenario that people can play with rather than everyone using like one option for everything, which is like Bennett, right? Yeah, it's also good for Mihoyo because they can sell more character if they can sell more niche character, yeah? So financially, it's good for Mihoyo if they make more niche and conditional character that works with specific elements. Weapon Banner. We already talked about the Red Horn, Stone Thresher, and Skyward Harp. I'll call it Stone Blade or Red Blade or Horn Blade. Red Horn, Stone Thresh, Stone Thresher, Red Horn. Ah! Stone Blade. So, we already talked about the Stone Blade recently. Good weapon. You can potentially use it even if you don't build defense and you can just build attack with the Stone Blade and just have an attack buffer to make up for any of the lost attack when using this weapon because you are benefiting from 88 crit damage and there's not a lot of sources to get more crit damage in the game. So, it's amazing. It's an amazing weapon. 
And then Skyward Harp. Skyward Harp is mainly used for the 20% crit damage and the 22% crit rate at refinement 1, which is roughly 60... 64 CV, right? There is like Polar Star, which is a newer weapon that has 66 CV at refinement 1. 12% damage from elemental skill, elemental burst, and it also gives you like, what, 50% attack, right? Like, that's the power crept version of Skyward Harp, but it is limited. And I'd say if you're trying to pull a weapon banner anyway, might as well pull for the best weapon. I'd say this weapon banner is a massive skip, but I do know that a lot of people are gonna try it though. They're gonna go to Ito and Goro banner, and like, hopefully pull an Ito and a Goro, and they'll have like five summons left. They walk to the weapon banner and go, hey, what if? What if I get the weapon? <laughs> it happens so often. A lot of my viewers do that. It's, it's actually, it's actually inhaling pure copium. It's like addicted to summoning. Yeah, I know I'm talking about being addicted to summoning. I'm not the best example of that, but like, Hear me out, right? I don't follow my own advices. So, this weapon banner, unless you play Ito a lot, and if you really like Ito, I wouldn't pull this weapon banner. If you're thinking about pulling this weapon banner because the Claymore can be an alternative to other Claymore, 5 star, just because of the crit damage, then go ahead, but make sure you have a bow character as well, just in case. Claymore and Jin Yan? Yeah, Claymore is gonna be good on Jin Yan. That'll be the very quick one, right? Anything else? We have Ito Storyline. Yeah? Ito Storyline, that's it, right? Goro Trailer. Yeah, that's also Goro Trailer, right? Let, let us see. The key to seizing victory in battle lies in remembering the meaning of battle. Oh. And employing the right tactics to generate momentum, making your forces unstoppable. With momentum on our side and close camaraderie, we are unstoppable. General Goro of the Watatsumi Island Resistance ready and waiting. The ears wiggle. <laughs> the wiggle ears. What the fuck? Okay. General Goro of the Watatsumi Island Resistance ready and waiting. Even his ability looks adorable. Yeah, I mean, we already played Goro during the playtest of the um, Hangout event. Everyone on me! Thank you for your guidance. This is a victory that belongs to the both of us. Well, that's cute. 